Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how to send interactive WhatsApp message using WhatsApp Business API. So with the API, you can actually send interactive buttons like this, uh, which the message include quick replies and call to action buttons. You can also personalize the information in the message, such as the time and the date. So to do this, it's actually just require a few lines of code that I'm going to show you. So first of all, you have to install um, a few libraries. Um, you have to install the Wati API and a few libraries that we specify here. So after we install the Wati library, we can start using it. Um, so first of all, we need to import it. And then we have to initialize the client with the endpoint and the token. So, so where we get the endpoint? Um, so here we will use the uh, Wati Sandbox endpoint. And we also can register the token at the Wati website. Um, so here I have a register, a trial account, uh, which I get a token. And then I'm ready to send a message. Let me run the cell. So now we have the uh, Wati clients. So how we send the message? Um, I will first initialize the template parameter, which is a lesser parameter to be used in the WhatsApp message. So here I already have a list of uh, parameter I want to customize, which is the name, uh, place, the dates, and so on. So finally, I have to send the WhatsApp message to the client that I want to send to. Um, so here I will call the send template network, which consists of three parameter, uh, WhatsApp number, template name, and the template parameter. So the WhatsApp number is the number that you want to send to. Uh, here I will send it to myself. I will put a dummy here, number. And then I will put the template name, uh, which already defined uh, previously. And there will be another video show you how to submit your template. So here I will type the template name, which is a uh, appointment reminder with buttons. And then finally, I will uh, put the template parameter, which I initialize here. Um, so I will do this. And it turns. So this is the method that you will be used to send uh, the template um, to the number and the parameter you want to customize. Um, so after you run this, you should be able to get a message. So now, as you can see, I received a message like this in my WhatsApp with just a few lines of code. 